So I think it's about time I started texturing Pipe Dream. For the past while, it's really just been the same solid colors for each instrument, but you know, I could do much better than that. Now, changing the color and texture values of each part one by one doesn't sound very fun to me. So instead of doing that, what's more fun is I designed an automatic system to do it for me. Uh, here's how it works. I want to run the game in F8 mode and be able to adjust the color properties directly, kinda like what you can do with the camera editor. Alongside all my other build scripts, there's a final texture script. The textures themselves are controlled with these spheres down here, hidden out of view. They all just hold the texture information in one place. The script works by having two main tables, selectors and selector functions. Selectors is the lookup table where you give it a texture name and it tells you exactly which parts should have that texture applied to it. It has no repeats and every in-game part has a unique selector associated with it. It's fairly simple. Where it's not so simple is the selector functions table. This table is an ordered list of functions which really act more as a paintbrush. The whole stage is the canvas and the functions layer on top which should be colored. They're very broad at first, i.e. every instrument starts out pipe colored, and then the details are specified later on. It's very helpful to think of these functions like layers in a Photoshop file. The top details take priority over the background. In fact, to generate the selectors table, I iterate through the table backwards and set all the details first. I keep track of which parts have been assigned to in the taken table. If a part is already taken, ignore it. This builds up the selectors table, which allows me to very easily try out different textures, prototype, colors, lighting, all that. Thanks to iMac for providing his Blender set as a texture reference, which I will be using in the future. Uh, this is what the textures look like right now, just my first attempt, which I'll revise. Uh, do check out his Pipe Dream Redux if you haven't already. Uh, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching.